Notice, your safety and the safety of others are important to Honda. Always refer to the owner's manual for clarification and more detail on the processes shown in this video. Welcome to the Honda Power Equipment video on HRX Series Lawn Mower Maintenance. In this video, we'll show you how to properly and safely perform basic maintenance on your HRX Series Lawn Mower. Honda always recommends using Honda Genuine Parts when performing any maintenance on your lawn mower. Honda Genuine Parts are designed and manufactured to the precise standards as the original parts. Oil changes should be performed at regular intervals according to the owner's manual to ensure long service life. It is best to drain used oil when the engine is warm, not hot. With the engine off, turn the fuel valve to the off position. Remove any dirt and debris from around the oil dipstick and then remove the dipstick. Place a suitable container next to the mower to catch the used oil. Tilt the mower to the right with the fuel cap up to prevent fuel leaks. Allow the used oil to fully drain through the oil fill tube. Once drained, Refill with 10W30 oil, being careful not to overfill by occasionally checking the level with the dipstick. Once you've verified the oil is at the proper level, screw in the dipstick until it is tight. A properly maintained air filter will help prevent dust from entering your engine. Dust entering the carburetor can cause premature engine wear as well as starting or running problems. You will need to clean the filter more frequently if you operate the lawnmower in very dusty conditions. Press down on the tabs to remove the cover. Remove the filter from the air cleaner housing and inspect it. If the filter is in good shape, clean it by tapping it several times on a hard surface to remove loose dirt. If the filter is in poor condition or very dirty, replace it. Wipe any dirt from the air filter housing with a clean, moist rag. Be careful not to get dirt in the carburetor inlet. Finally, reinstall the filter and the cover. Be sure the hinges on the bottom of the cover are hooked into the housing and the tabs are latched into the top of the housing. A properly sharpened blade is essential for optimal grass cutting. To inspect the blades, turn the fuel valve to the off position and disconnect the spark plug cap from the spark plug. Tilt the mower to the right so the fuel cap is up to prevent fuel leakage. Inspect the blades for damage, cracks, and excessive wear, rust, or corrosion. A dull blade can be sharpened, but a blade that is excessively worn, bent, or cracked must be replaced. Blades should be sharpened by trained professionals at an authorized Honda servicing dealer. When replacing your lawnmower blades, always use Honda Genuine Replacement Blades. To replace the blade, turn the fuel valve off and disconnect the spark plug cap. Tilt the mower to the right so the fuel cap is up to prevent fuel leakage. Remove the two blade bolts with a 14 millimeter socket wrench while using a wooden block to prevent the blades from rotating. Install the replacement blades using the two blade bolts and special washers. The washers must be installed with the concave side toward the blades. The blade bolts and washers are specially designed to secure the mower blades to the engine. Do not use any other type of bolt or washer. You must have a torque wrench to properly tighten the bolts to 36 to 43 foot-pounds. If you don't have a torque wrench, then take your lawnmower to the dealer to have the bolts properly tightened. Properly tightened blade bolts are critical to ensure safe operation. The spark plug must be properly gapped and free of carbon deposits. Allow the engine to cool before removing the spark plug. To inspect the spark plug, 
Disconnect the spark plug cap and remove any dirt from around the spark plug area. Remove the spark plug with a 21 millimeter spark plug wrench. Inspect the spark plug and replace it if it is fouled, the electrodes are worn, or if the insulator is cracked or chipped. Measure the spark plug electrode gap with a spark plug gap gauge. The gap should be 0.7 to 0.8 millimeters. Install the spark plug carefully by hand to avoid cross-threading. If reinstalling the old spark plug, tighten 1 8 to 1 quarter turn after the spark plug seats. If installing a new spark plug, tighten 1 half turn after the spark plug seats to compress the sealing washer. Do not over tighten the spark plug. It may be necessary to clean the grass bag periodically to maintain good lawnmower performance. Wash the bag with a garden hose and allow it to dry completely before using it since a wet bag will clog quickly. If the grass bag has excessive wear, tears or holes, replace it. This concludes the video tutorial on HRX series lawnmower maintenance. Always refer to the owner's manual for clarification and more detail on the processes shown in this video.